So hello everybody. Happy New Year. First video of 2018. And first vloggy kind of style video. Vloggy? Would you consider this one a vlog? You can tell from the B-roll, having a cup of tea. You know, I primarily am a coffee lover, but I decided to try hot tea recently. I mean, all those people in like China and England and well, basically everybody across the pond drinks tea a ton. So I figured I'd give it a try and I actually enjoy it. It's good. I don't know that I enjoy it quite as much as coffee. It's good nevertheless. I enjoy it. Lots to go over because we haven't done a video like this. I've uh, been doing a lot of reviews and stuff lately. I'm trying to redo the pantry for my wife today. So first update, um, I don't know if you saw from the B-roll, but we have some new members of the family. They're two Boston Terriers, uh, Lucy and Winston. And they are six months old? Um, five. They'll be six months at the end of the month. They'll be six months old at the end of this month. The reason we have two new dogs is because, unfortunately, our beloved Hanky is no longer with us. We had to put him down due to complications from a surgery. Um, it was unfortunate. We spent more money than I care to mention uh, trying to save him, but in the end, no amount of money or anything really mattered. Uh, and the best thing and kind of the most humane thing was to just kind of put him out of his misery because he was suffering pretty bad. He couldn't even walk anymore. So that was sad. but. On an up note, the two new dogs are really cute. They, they really are. I mean, we'll miss Hanky, we always will, but nothing makes you feel better about losing a dog than puppies, because puppies are adorable. Hold on, I'll get them. I'll get one of them. <laughs> Winston, <laughs> he was sleeping, so he looks a little, uh... Tired. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy, did I wake you up? His ears are down. His ears are down. Normally his ears stand straight up. He's having no part of it, though. Winston, Mr. Sleepy Face. No. Lulu. Lulu. But her actually, we call her Lucy, and sometimes they call her Lucy Lou, but her real name is Lucille. Her name is Lucy. We call her Lucy Lou. Both of them are actually from the same litter. Quick note on the dogs, since we're talking about the dogs. Uh, we got them from the same litter, and Jason and Elaine, our friends that you've seen on the vlog a billion times, uh, they got a boy and a girl from the same litter. So when I went down, I actually got four out of the same litter, and we kept two, Jason and Elaine have two. They have Rico and Anya, and when we get them all together, they're all brothers and sisters, they all have a great time. Secondly, uh, I need to get going. It's, it's freezing here. It, I mean, it's freezing here. Uh, we live in Florida. It was like 29 last, it was like 29 last night, which for people in Florida is freaking freezing. Uh, well, it technically is, but anything below 32 is freezing. So I mean, it really is freezing, which I know people that live up north are probably like, screw you guys, it was zero here last night or below zero, I get you. But for Florida, that is really cold. We, we're not equipped, but really uh, that's enough for updates now. I need to get going because we've got to get this pantry started or we're not going to get it done because it's already almost two o'clock. We gotta get going. Okay. Okay. My name is Jeff. okay, so first off, the pantry. It's it's not a very big pantry, which is part of the issue because you got five people in this house, three of which are kids, one of which is me who eats a lot. Okay. Know what I'm saying? So it's it's a lot. And you know, don't, I'm gonna show you, but don't judge us for the somewhat not organized fashion. Just wait. Yeah, see, and this down here is just, it's a disaster. And that, that's the recycle and it just ends up, it's, it's just bad. It's, it's bad. And the rest of it, we try to keep, you know, fairly neat, organized. I mean, there's some crap here because I'm filming, but uh, for the most part, we, we try to keep everything fairly squared away. And the pantry is making my, you've heard me use this term a lot, my OCD itch. And it's making Allison's, uh, everybody's OCD is flaring up and itching. So we're trying to resolve that. Step one, remove all Yes. By the way, 
Edge Pro Apex, like one of the best knife sharpeners ever. Uh, might do a video on it sometimes. That might be good. It's really, really sharpened. I mean, shave the hair off a dolphin sharp. Real syrup. Me and the wife argue about this. She likes the Aunt Jemima and the sugar free. This, to me, it's only a real maple syrup or forget about it. I'm sure any of my buddies in Canada would agree with me on that. Everything's marked off though, ready to start cutting shelves. I think it's break time. Yeah, time for a break. Yep. All right, got some coffee, cigar, I don't hear any grief. I know cigars aren't good for you, but I like them. So every now and then when I relax, I, I have a cigar. So it is what it is. I try to counterbalance it with eating healthy, staying physically active, drinking this green juice, which I'm gonna have to do a video on the green juice that we drink sometimes. It's really, really good for you. It tastes like crap, but man, you feel great after you drink it. While we're having our break, I thought this would be a good time to uh, catch up for a minute. I hope everybody's doing well. I hope everybody had a great holiday. I hope everybody's excited about 2018. I am. We had a great Christmas here. All the kids had a, a great time. It was uh, waking up Christmas morning and, and seeing the kind of kids' reaction to Santa bringing the gifts and stuff is, is, is a pretty great experience. So I'm always a pretty big fan of this time of year. My plans for 2018, as far as YouTube goes, the kind of review slash overview slash kind of tech stuff I've been doing a lot of lately, how-to stuff like that, uh, seem to be pretty popular. They do pretty well. So I'll probably this year focus on doing a little more of those. I still really enjoy doing these vlogs. Uh, I'm definitely gonna keep doing the vlogs. This year, I say this every year, but this year I really am gonna try to make it to two uploads a week. I'm gonna make it a priority this year to try to get out two a week. It is freezing here. I think I mentioned it earlier. I don't, you can't really see. I've got like a heater thing back here behind me, which is keeping it somewhat warm. Well, that's enough of me blabbing. Just wanted to kind of catch up with you guys. We're gonna get back to doing this shelf in a few minutes, but yeah, I'm gonna finish this cigar and this cup of coffee and uh, we'll finish up in a few. They get so excited. It's like the Blair Witch Project. Oh God, it's, it's all gone awry. It's all gone awry. It's all scratching. Oh, Ow. We gotta get up, we gotta get out of here, Jared. We gotta run, we gotta run. We gotta run. Run, run away. Oh yeah, oh yeah, Jeez. You guys are crazy. Okay. Here's the deal. Did not get done today. I quit for tonight because it's late. And some of the stuff that I've got left to do is really needs to be done outside in the driveway where it's not gonna like get sawdust everywhere. So it's dark, it's cold. I'm not going out there and doing it. Plus I'll probably wake up my neighbors and they won't like me. So we're gonna call it a night. We'll pick this up to finish it. Minyana. All right, we're back. It's the next morning. Before we get cranking today, I am going to jump to the sauna. That is part of my 
Uh, goal for 2018 is to do better about doing some healthy things. So you might be thinking, why do you want to get into a sauna every day, Jeremy? Well, you know, a sauna, a little wood room type thing, gets hot. Well, why you want to do that is kind of goes back to, um, I don't know if you've ever seen my sprout video I made, but I watch a lot of Joe Rogan and there's this lady that comes on there called Dr. Rhonda Patrick, genius lady. And uh, they talked about the benefits of sauna. You should look it up online. Super really good for you to get into a uh, sauna every day. Look up Dr. Rhonda Patrick or uh, just do health benefits of sauna. Sweat it out, it's good. Hot, very hot. Whew. Feels good though. All right, and that's it. Feel a lot more put together. Time to get day. Still not done. Some time has elapsed. Allison. I'll show you real quick. Hold on. Allison on paint detail. <laughs> Looking good. Got uh, shelves all in. What up, that ass? Oh, God. <laughs> uh, got all the shelves Excuse in. Me. Allison's actually good at painting, so she offered to do her part and do some of the painting in there so I could kind of clean up. As you can see, the kitchen is still in mass disarray. I am gonna make me and Allison some coffee. I think we're gonna be burning the midnight oil, so we're gonna make some Cuban coffee. That should perk us right up. <laughs> it's the next day. We fell asleep. <laughs> we painted till like two in the morning and um, yeah, we, we just, suck at it. We suck at painting, so. So it's the next morning, we went to sleep. We painted for four hours and didn't get out of one We've Yeah, that was the result of four hours of painting. Still <laughs> not done. So, we're going to the big guns. I'm not gonna lie, anytime I wear this, I made an Instagram post about it, I feel a little like a stormtrooper. No? I think I even sound like one. Break time. Dude, this is horrible. Can you, can you see that? Can you see? And I know, no, what I'm saying is not horrible is, is the fact that my hair is in dreads, which some of you might think is gross, but it's really not. I wash my hair all the time, but I just started them actually. They're only a few months old, which is why they still look a little ratty. They, they take time to like fully mature into the, but anyway, point being, I backed into the wall and got a bunch of paint. Now it looks like I have like gray hair or I'm storm from X-Men or something. Holy crap, that tea's hot. PG tips. For all you guys that might be from England, supposedly this is England's number one tea. I don't know if that's true. I love it though, so. This is officially the project that will not die. <laughs> this freaking pantry, which should have taken like a day, has taken. Three or four hours, like, he said. <laughs> that's what he said. Take it like three, that three or four hours. Three, three, or four, three or four days. That was on Thursday. Well, I've never worked with contact paper. <laughs> and we were going to not paint the tops of the shelves. We were going to put contact paper on them because we figured it'd be more durable. However, I've never worked with contact paper and did not realize that contact paper does not stick to raw yeah. wood, I suppose. So I had to repaint the shelves, the tops of the shelves, waiting for them to dry. This has been our life for like three days. I officially hate this fucking pantry. <laughs> hate it. Allison's resorted to drinking wine. She's. That's the one kind of downfall of Boston Terriers. They're uh, a little snorry. Yeah, but it's kind of endearing in a way.
captain's log day 315. We didn't want to try to put the contact paper in too soon, so we decided just to give the paint overnight to dry before we started. So this morning will be the last day of this project. If you can hear Allison laughing in the background, that's because I've said this for about two days now. But it's gonna be it today. This is it. I feel it. This is the day we're gonna finish. Finally, the pantry that wouldn't die, the project that wouldn't finish, is done. And no, I'm not gonna finish this video or I'm not gonna end this video without showing you at least a clip of it. It's not a big deal. It's only a pantry. So I don't wanna make a huge deal about it but it did take the better part of like four or five days to get done. So we're extremely pleased that this project is done. It's over. It is a lot nicer uh, having the pantry neat and organized. Should have done it a long time ago. I know this video is a little all over the place, but so was this project. I feel like the video reflected the madness that was this uh, pantry redo. But in any event, I hope you guys enjoyed it. We enjoyed making the first vlog of 2018. If you did enjoy it, hit that like button down there so we know you enjoyed it. As always, if you're not a subscriber, please consider doing so, and we will see you guys in the next video. I was standing outside.